All right, why did I move to Boatsfjord? Can I tell the story? Okay, so I saw, let me get this, make myself a little smaller here. I saw this article right here on the local and it said uh, the incentives to attract people to Northern Norway, lower taxes. That's why I went to Boatsfjord, lower taxes. I read this article and I saw that residents of Finnmark and North Troms pay a base rate of 18.5% on their taxes, right? So I was thinking, I was thinking, like I used to live in Svalbard and the taxes there are 15.9%. So I was thinking like, oh man, you know, like living on Svalbard, you gotta live on Svalbard to get those taxes. If you can live on the mainland, even if it's in Finnmark, I mean, 18.5% taxes is amazing. I was paying 34% taxes in Trumza, so if I could even make my same salary and go to Finnmark where I was making 18 and a half percent, that's like a big raise. I can't remember the math now. I think it was, that's like giving, that's like getting 70 more kroner an hour to do the same thing. And then your rent is going to go from like 11,000, 12,000 in Trumza to like 5,000 for the same apartment. So you're making more and spending less. I was like, yeah, that's a win. So I moved to Bosphere and Bosphere was really nice. I thought it was a beautiful place. It's Finnmark, there's not a lot of people there. There's only like 2,000 people there, but that was my house right there, circled. And the snow is the snow. I mean, I'd already been in Trumza, already been in Svalbard, already been in Alaska. I mean, you know, I wasn't tripping about the snow because there's no such thing as bad weather, just bad clothing. And you see, I got good clothing on, so I wasn't worried about that. Now, the thing is that <laughs> I should have double checked the tax thing because like I said, I assumed that meant that I was only going to pay 18 and a half percent taxes like on my pay. So my paycheck would come only 18 and a half percent taxes be taken out of it. And I didn't do any research. <laughs> That's a bad thing. Past that one article I saw. So when I got there and I got to work, I started talking to the other people and I was like, Hey, you know, so is it true? Like, do you only pay 18 and a half percent taxes? Like I'm already spending money I don't even have, right? I'm like, oh man, you know, I could do this, I could do that, I could do this. And, I, and everyone is like, no, nah, we pay 28%, 26%, 30%, 32%, whatever, right? So I was like, well, pff. you know what I mean? The only reason I went there was to pay less taxes. So if I wasn't gonna pay less taxes, it was kind of like, why am I here? You know, yeah, my rent was a lot cheaper, but I mean, I'm in Finnmark, <laughs> you know what I mean? They have all those incentives to help people, to get people to move to Finnmark because nobody wants to live in Finnmark. <laughs> I mean, do you want to live in Finnmark? No, I don't think so. So, um, and that says nothing bad about the people. Like I said, the people of Bosfjord, I love the people there. Everything is, you know, it's just, you're still in Finnmark. And so, you know, once I figured out that, I was like, oh, then I'm going to move. So I just thought... I've never been to Bergen before, um, and I wanted to check it out. I heard good things about Bergen, so I I went to Bergen. And you know, and I don't know if the Finnmark tax thing comes like at the end of the year when you're paying taxes. Maybe like then you'll end up getting more money back or whatever. But I wasn't trying to get more money back later. I was trying to pay less money now. <laughs> so yeah, after uh, three months of bullshit, I was like, hey man, peace. <laughs>